Hi, I'm Rio, and you might see me pop up with helpful chats from time to time, as I'm here to make sure that everyone using Ticket Taylor gets the most out of our platform and anyone with questions gets back on track as soon as possible. Before showing you how to create events, I wanted to show you a few great examples of what we're aiming for. With Ticket Tailor, you can either embed the checkout as a widget directly in your website, or you can use the customizable event page that we build for you. There's loads more great examples on our website. Right, let's get an event set up. Now there's thousands of types of events and ticketing needs, but I'm going to show you a fairly standard event in this demo. However, along the way, I'll point out certain features that you might need to explore if you're doing something a little bit more complex. Get started by adding your event info into this simple form. I'm going to do a candle making workshop. It's going to happen just on one day, but if you're running a recurring event, you can use this checkbox to select that option, and you'll be able to add your dates and times on the next page. You also have the option to schedule online events, although mine's in person. The description box is where you can really sell your event writing all the information people need to know, adding photos, videos, and links as well. You can even add HTML in here. You can also upload your event page image and a header image to really sell your event. Now the important part, let's create some ticket types. It's super easy to add your tickets. Just enter your ticket name, the price, and the quantity. You can stop there if you want, or you can expand the advanced settings to add things like a description and a booking fee. Booking fees are great if you want to pass on your fees to your customer and sell your tickets for free. There's loads of other settings as well, like hiding your tickets or adding them behind a password that enable you to do loads of cool things. You can also group your tickets together and set limits on the quantity sold per group. And you can also bundle your tickets which is where you can add a group of tickets together and sell them for a special promotional price, like a family ticket or a couple's booking in my example. Furthermore, if you're selling tickets in a venue, you can add your seating chart really easily. There's loads more advanced settings down here. I won't go through them all today in this demo, but I do want to highlight our donations feature. It's free to take donations, and they really do help make a difference in lots of events running on our platform. Once you've filled in your event details, click save, and you can preview what you've put together. This is my event page. In just a few minutes, I've set it up. It looks great. It's nearly ready to go. You can go through the checkout process as if you were making a booking, and if you're happy with it, we're basically ready to publish. Just the important part to go, deciding how you want to get paid. I'm going to link to my Stripe account in this demo. It's just a few clicks and I'll be connected to my Stripe account where I'll get paid directly. However, you can also link to Square and PayPal and offer offline payments, such as bank transfer or cash payment. And that's it. But there are a few more features that can make event day even easier. You can edit your checkout form to ask specific questions to your ticket buyers and attendees. This is useful if you want to find out specific information that will help you manage your event even easier. You can ask any questions that you like, like dietary requirements, phone numbers, or if they want to opt in for marketing emails. It's really easy to get this data out of Ticket Taylor, and I'll show you where that comes later in the video. Another really awesome feature is our email broadcast feature. This is a tool that allows you to send important event information to your ticket buyers. Something I really recommend doing is adding a ticket reminder set up to send a day before the event so people aren't scrabbling around in their emails looking for their tickets. Again, you can add images, text, links, videos, whatever you want here. Or you can just leave it with our standard tickets. To put the finishing touches on your event, 
you can use our design studio to pick the colours of your event page. You can use our preset templates, or if you've got strong brand colours, enter them yourself with the hex codes. Once you're completely happy with your event, you can share it wherever you like, social media and your mailing list, or even using a QR code on a physical post around your town. And now your event's set up and live and you've started selling tickets, it's time to explore our tools which make managing your event super easy. We offer complete management features. From the orders page you can add and manage all of your orders, including exporting all of your information, cancelling, refunding and transferring events as well as filtering your information to easily look up the orders that you're interested in. To help with your event marketing, we offer different promotions, like the ability to add a discount code for a fixed amount or a percentage, a voucher code for selling on sites like Groupon, and even the ability to sell a gift voucher directly from Ticket Tailor itself. Another amazing feature that we offer is the option to add a product. You can sell these by themselves or add them as an add-on to your event. For example, a box of popcorn with a cinema ticket or some drinks during the experience. Just fill in the information and select whether you'd like to sell it in your store or upsold with events. Upsold products can also be issued with a QR code so they're really easy to check in, just like a ticket. For places like venues and tours and attractions, we also offer memberships. Memberships are really easy to set up, similar to gift vouchers, and they can be redeemed just by scanning on the check-in app, being offered special promotions or a hidden ticket, however you like really. You can use our pre-built reports to check out your sales as they happen live or you can export all of your order data and use it however you like. This makes it really easy to keep on top of your marketing strategy and your ongoing sales. Now I'm going to show you how to manage your box office settings. Your box office is your account where all of your events will live. Here you can do things like invite all of your team members with different permissions so they can have their own login completely for free. You can also add your users to the check-in app and again you can restrict exactly what they see here. For more advanced users, we offer lots of app connections like Apple Wallet Passes, Facebook and TikTok Pixel, Google Analytics, MailChimp, Zapier, a whole host of really useful tools that you can connect your box office to. If you want to build something custom, you can also access the Ticket Tailor API. That's a very brief intro to Ticket Tailor and some of the features we have. But obviously, we have a lot more that we haven't gone into detail with today. If you're looking for something specific, check out our features page or contact customer support. Or if you're feeling brave, sign up and create a free account where you can test out everything yourself. <laughs>